We are finally getting more rain across the state and some areas really needed it. This summer's drought paired with limited water from LCRA will cost some farmers thousands this season. KXN, KXN's Jayla Washington explains. It is just one step at a time for rice farmer Tim Gertson near the Houston area. That's his mentality because you never know what a day out on the field will bring. As droughts worsen and get more intense, uh, the consequences for rice farming there starts to be more of demand on that natural resource on water. The Lower Colorado River Authority, or LCRA, cut farmers in its supply areas off this season on July 1st. It's simply following its water management plan to help with the preservation of water. What happens when, when we get cut off for our second crop water is we're unable to grow the portion of our crop that we can grow the most efficiently and the most profitable. The consequence uh, to me personally is around the tune $150,000 to $200,000 in lost profit. So as you can see, they are chopping down their first crop of rice, which is in fairly good condition from what my friend Ralph here tells me. But still, this season there has not been enough rain and there's just not enough water. Well, this is second crop rice that's growing right now but this field doesn't have any water for second crop, so this is gonna die. Now, luckily for Gertson, he does get some of his water from a well on his property to help grow crops, but that's not always enough to get the job done, and it isn't something that's sustainable for all farmers since building a well is so expensive. Now, as Gertson tries to figure out how to use less water to grow his crop, he grapples with the reality that there are other things that will make his job much harder. We don't have extra water. We're already having to fight over it. To bring new businesses into a state that's already struggling, I think is really irresponsible. That was Jayla Washington reporting. The farmer that Jayla spoke with tells us that they're always trying to figure out ways to use less water to grow rice, like new methods that require a shorter growing season or even permanently reducing acres where they're planting their crops. This story is part of a new series called Dried Up that KXAN is bringing you on our growing water crisis. This is a partnership with the political website, The Hill. Look for those stories here and on demand at kxan.com. Just click under the news tab.